I don't have to remind myself to think about those right. things because it's just sort of happening naturally, and I catch them really quickly. Well, and that's I'd like to. That's bur That's why practice is so important yeah. in jujitsu, in basketball, in thinking. If you practice the moves, if you practice these these things that we've been showing folks, you know, literally within weeks, you're going to see yeah. a complete difference in the way you approach the world and see the world. But pretty soon you won't have to um, you won't have to think about it because it'll just come naturally. You burn the neurons and your brain takes that path that you burned because it's been burned yeah. enough times that, oh, it's a path now. It used to be a jungle. Mm -hmm. It used to be a jungle that you were hitting through with machete and it was hard work every time. Right. But then it becomes a path and then you're just cruising the path. And the more you cruise the path, the more the path is crucible. Yeah, it, it really comes down to the practice. So, again, stepwise, fine. Buckets, fine. If it's for learning. Well, and knowing that that's not how the patterns actually exist. Yeah, exactly. In real in the real world. Exactly. We can linearize them and we can categorize them as a way to understand them and apply them. Yes. To sort of build that muscle memory. But the truth is, in the real world, they're all happening all the time. All the time. Um. Yeah around anything that you're thinking about. Yeah. And because um, I remember, gosh, it was a long time ago now. There, I think you're right. It was probably a few weeks where I was sort of really reminding myself in every, like, in every conversation I was having at work and then mm -hmm. also at home. And then I also remember every time I was trying to sort of get something started, whether it was a personal project or a work project, I remember saying to myself, have I paid attention to the distinctions I'm making? Have I thought about how I'm organizing the parts of this thing. I remember, I really, rem I have a very vivid memory of that being something I did very consciously for a, a little while. And then it sort of clicks, which I guess means it can happen for anybody. And yes. some people probably would be faster than me and might take a little longer than me. Who knows? I mean, I would also say that, you know, this is the way your brain thinks. This is the way your brain is working at the subconscious level. So the more you do this, the more you're going to see of that subconscious stuff that you're doing that's affecting your whole life, your behaviors, your moods, your emotions, your decisions, yeah, the predictions that you're making as you walk through your day. And to some extent, our society and our and our um, especially our school systems, unfortunately, kind of train us out of this natural form of thinking, this form of thinking that you get from nature, from being in nature and things like that, and from being part of nature. Yeah. Um, and so, I mean, I think that's why our, why the research shows that, you know, getting out in nature is so critical because it connects you with this kind of thinking, which is the most natural kind of thinking. It's the kind of thinking you were born into. Yeah. But then we get trained out of it. So once you start practicing, you're going to get trained back into it and it's going to feel so natural once you start practicing. Then then you, you'll be like, oh, my God, this this feels right. You know, this feels like like mm -hmm. the way it should be. That's right. And I've been missing this for all these years because I, you know, started caring about what the right answer was in school and, and, and like thinking in these tunnels, these linear tunnels yeah. to get the right answer, or yeah. get the, the cookie. Well, and, and also because... The Scooby Snack. The Scooby Snack. Well, those are for dogs, but yes. Yeah, like go... That's <laughs> a seal. <laughs> Scooby's a it's dog. It's all snacks. <laughs> to get the... All snacks all the way down. <laughs> Everybody wants a snack of some sort. 